Hello, my name is Stanley, and I will show you how to make uh, sliders with encoder. So first, you will go into the website 192.168.43.1 semicolon 8080. Now you click on blocks, and then just click on create new op mode, and name it whatever you want. I will just name it Stanley. So now you will go to actuators, DC motor, and then click on this one that's set mo LB mode to run mode run without encoder. Click on that, drag it on top of put in initialization blocks here and change it to slider left or and then change this to run using encoder now you copy that and paste it and put change this to slider right now i would go to dc motor and set lb direction to reverse and put it over here and change it to any slider you want and then put it to reverse because our spool is facing in a different direction than our motor so we just change one to reverse now you will go to logic and then click on if do drag it over here and then go to gamepad and then click on this one gamepad 1.8 and drag it right next to the if statement the if now you want to make the sliders go up using encoders so you go to dc motor and then find scroll down and then find this one that's set Target position to zero. Click on that and then put it over here right next to the do and then change this to slider left and then set it to 1500 and then copy it and paste it and change this one to slider right. Now I would put the set power so then it would move I'll change it to 0 0.4 so it doesn't go too quickly or too slowly and then go to DC motor and then click on this one and then drag it over here and then change it to slider left and change this one to run to position so it can run to its target position which is 1500 now i'll duplicate this and change it to slider right lastly i will add a sleep and then i'll change it to 10,000 so it will be last for 10 seconds and then it will stay at the position. Now you can save the op mode and then test it out.